Understanding Trade Deficit Widens Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we explore the fascinating world of English language and its practical applications. Today, we're diving into an economic term that often pops up in news headlines, trade deficit widens. Whether you're an English language learner, a student of economics, or just curious about world events, understanding this phrase can really broaden your comprehension of global economic discussions. Let's break it down together. To understand the phrase, trade deficit widens, we first need to grasp what a trade deficit is. In simple terms, a trade deficit occurs when a country imports more goods and services than it exports. It's like if you spend more money buying things than you earn from selling items. Economically, this situation indicates that a country is consuming more from the rest of the world than it is selling to them. Now, let's dissect the phrase, trade deficit widens. The word, widens, here is key. It means that the trade deficit is getting larger. If we picture the trade deficit as a gap between imports and exports, this gap is becoming wider. So. When you hear that a country's trade deficit widens, it means that the difference between how much that country buys from abroad and how much it sells to other countries has increased. You might wonder, why is it important to know when a trade deficit widens? Well, a widening trade deficit can have various implications for a country's economy. It might affect the country's currency value, influence inflation rates, and impact the overall economic growth. For businesses and investors, understanding this concept can help in making informed decisions. For individuals, it sheds light on the country's economic health and potential changes in the job market. Let's look at some examples to make it clearer. Imagine country A usually imports goods worth $100 billion and exports goods worth $80 billion. Here, country A has a trade deficit of $20 billion. If, in the following year, imports stay the same but exports fall to $70 billion, the trade deficit has widened to $30 billion. This simple example shows how changes in trading patterns can affect the trade balance. I hope this video has helped clarify what it means when we say a trade deficit widens and why it's an important indicator in understanding a country's economic situation. Remember, economics is not just numbers and charts. It's about the flow of goods, services, and money that affects us all. Thank you for joining us today, and we hope this explanation makes following economic news a bit easier for you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insights into the English language and its myriad uses. See you in the next video.